hello guys welcome to c learning with new video in this video we will learn about uh, the stacking how to do a stacking in a huawei i have two switches uh, one is a master this is the master switch and this one is a slab switch so in this video we will learn about uh, the stacking we will stack these two switches so first of all i will put my console cable in a uh, master and uh, do the stack configuration and then i will put my uh, console cable in a secondary the above one switch and then i will uh, do the configuration of stack after that uh, we will connect the stack cables so here are stack cables so you can see that these are the huawei stack cables so we will then connect the stack cables and then switches will restart and uh, do in a stack so i have uh, two switches so one is a master and other one is a slab so uh, we will do a stacking uh, uh, so let's go toward the configuration so just restart i just restart my switches and both switches are empty so display current configuration so there is no any configuration in both switches so this one is a uh, master switch and the other one is a secondary switch and uh, its version is so you can see its version uh, is a huawei 6700 series so have a, has a firmware of uh, 2022 so uh, i will do stacking in this so first of all i will change the name system name sys name as uh, core switch uh, core uh, switch and then i will uh, go in a stack just go in a stack stack and then uh, stack stack member stack member 1 so just select the number 1 and then select the priority of uh, your device if there are uh, primary device you want to make the primary device as a 1 and the secondary device as a number 2 so you have to select the priority of the device so i am selecting this priority as 150 and then then a stack member 1 and then a uh, domain name so you we have to select the domain suppose we have the multiple uh, stacks so we have to select the domain that uh, this stack domain is uh, uh, 10 and the other stack domain is at uh, 20 so we have to select the domain so we have to select the domain then we uh, go in a uh, interface so interface stack sorry go back interface stack 1/1 and then uh, add the port you want to add suppose uh, i'm going back uh, display interface brief so i want to select uh, my 40g port as uh, stack ports so i am selecting these two port as uh, my stack ports so i'm select this port so just go here one and then add this port as a port member group interface 40g 1/0/1 and then yes yes and also uh, add an other port so just go in a stack port stack port sorry interface stack port 1/2 so uh, add another port so i am making two ports and then port member group interface 40g 1/0/2 so i am uh, adding two 40g second number 40g port in uh, stack port 2 and then yes yes and just go back and the save the configuration now go in a uh, uh, second device so i am in uh, my second switch so first of all i will change its name as a uh, core switch this name name core switch and then i will uh, uh, go in a stack stack and then stack member 
stack number one priority i will set the priority less than uh, the master one the master the master device has a priority 150 and this device has a priority of 120 and uh, stack member one and domain domain 10 stack stack member one and we will renumber this as a two then then go back and now we go in interface uh, stack port one slash one and then add our ports uh, the port member group uh, name is 40g sorry member interface 40g one slash zero slash one in this one yes yes and then we go in interface the uh, stack port one slash zero one slash two and add the uh, uh, port member group interface one slash zero slash two sorry 40 g 40 g one slash zero slash two yes and yes and then we now we uh, go and add the uh, stack cable so we have a uh, two device and two ports so on each device so we will uh, uh, put this port in a crossway so here is paint so suppose uh, this is my primary device of 150 and this is my secondary device who has priority of 120 so i will uh, connect this cable in a crossing crossway so one with two and this two with one so in a crossing way uh, i will uh, connect this stack when i will put the cables so switch will go to restart so i am going to put the cables so this one this uh, this one just put this cable hello welcome back so uh, it will take uh, uh, 5 to 10 minutes to reboot both devices so uh, uh, put your uh, console cable in a uh, primary device which was the master so uh, then access the uh, device and then display stack so now you can see here this is uh, this is this one is a standby on standby with the priority is 120 and this device is a master device and with the priority the higher the priority the master will be device so device with the higher priority is a master so now uh, display stack configuration all so now you can see here uh, we select this port so these are the uh, ports where domain is uh, 10 and the priority is 120 and other one priority is uh, 150 and then these are the stack ports the stack port 1 which was the 1 slash 1 uh, 40g and uh, 1 slash 2 is a 102 of uh, switch 1 so 101 and 102 uh, is the switch uh, 1 port which was the ma which one is master and the stack port 20 uh, uh, 2 slash 1 and uh, 2 slash 2 are the uh, stack ports on a scandy device uh, so you can see here the scandy switch 2 slash 0 slash 1 and it's renumber the uh, ports as a 1 slash uh, 0 slash 1 1 slash 0 slash 2 and on a scale this scandy device it renumber that 2 slash 0 slash 1 so uh, if you go uh, display uh, interface brief so you will see the combined ports of both device so the primary device ports are renumbered as 1 slash 0 slash 1 1 slash 0 slash 2 all the port are these 24 ports of primary device and the other ports other device ports is showing here this is the uh, secondary device port which is the slave and its ports are renumbered as 2 slash 0 slash 1 so all the the this 24 port of uh, uh, primary device and 24 port of scandy device uh, slave device are showing here 
combinedly. So now here are some 40G ports. Uh, one slash zero slash three, one slash zero slash four, because one slash zero slash one and one slash zero slash two are uh, uh, in a stack. So they are not showing here because they are in a stack. And uh, on device two, two slash zero slash one and two slash zero slash two are uh, the part of stack ports. So they are not uh, present here. And the other remaining ports are present here. These one ports are from uh, 40G ports from primary and these 40G ports from secondary device. So here you can see here the stack port 1, 40G and stack port 2 and here are from stack. If you go display stack, stack uh, member all, sorry. Uh, sorry display stack display stack topology topology so you can see here the stack na port number 40g we connect this in cross with the uh, 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 switch one the master switch port uh, one with the uh, second number of uh, uh, slab switch we connect this in cross you can see here verify here so uh, 101 connect to 202 and uh, 102 connect to 201 so these are connect in a cross so here as well here is the same so uh, this is the all about the configuration of a stack so uh, thank you very much see you in next video if you have any question about stacking so you can ask in comment